city of Minot's budget could be close to 50% less than last year. That's according to preliminary budget talks at Monday's city council meeting. Reporter PJ Walker explains where the dramatic decrease is expected to come from and how COVID-19 has had an impact. Finance Director Dave Lakefield says the 2021 budget is expected to be $143 million. That's $129 million less than last year. He says the main reason for the huge drop is a change in how state funds and large projects are accounted for. Last year, you know, the push was made to include uh, the state portion of, uh, for example, flood control, the NAS project, some of our DOT road projects, uh, to include the state's portion of those projects in our budget as well. So that increased the budget considerably last year. As mayors across the country urge Congress to send more than $300 billion directly to cities to help with lost revenue due to COVID-19, Lakefield says the city's losses and gains have seemed to level out. In most cases, you know, those increased costs for uh, precautionary measures are being offset by reductions in other areas. For example, travel, you know, our, our travel is way down. We're not traveling uh, nearly to the extent that we were before. Another example, CARES Act funding offset lost revenue at the airport, which took a major hit early on in the pandemic. Mayor Sean Sitma says even though the budget is projected to be less next year, it might not stay that way in years to come, as many projects that were put off this year will come eventually. But something that might excite taxpayers, property taxes. We see a flat budget in terms of property taxes. Now, that can also be a little bit um, deceiving sometimes because if a home value is increased, uh, whether it's some renovations or upgrades and things like that, uh, every house, of course, is different. But by and large, our mill levy rate, which is how that's calculated, is flat. It's not going up. It's not going down. There will be a Q&A session at the next city council meeting for the public to attend and ask questions about the budget. Then the budget will go forward for the first and second reading. Reporting in Minot for KX News, I'm PJ Walker. Lakefield says city officials are also anticipating the money that the North Dakota Emergency Commission approved earlier this week. That money will go into the city's general fund and would not be reflected in the budget.